everybody. Here is Chris, Chris Squid Gaming, and I'm doing a tutorial on how to use OBS. If you don't have OBS installed, sorry, that was my last search. Search open broad broadcaster software. Uh, open broad caster software right there open broadcaster software and click open broadcaster software index so we go there and click your version I have Windows 10 so I clicked this one when I did a download then it'll ask run click run and then in your taskbar after it's done running it should pop up a little thing new thing click on it it'll come up you click next and then all that agreeing stuff and then you will be given with a screen that won't have this you see how this is like this is when you're recording this is what it looks like I'm showing you how to do a motion capture rec recording not a game capture and this is using a laptop so you need to do something very special for a laptop first things first I'll create a new one just to show you guys what to do I know this is, looks very annoying but it's okay add scene and you can name it whatever you want doesn't matter the name I'll just name it I'll just name it example 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 and then simply name it that and then as you see there's nothing here I'm gonna go back into this so guys as you see there's nothing there so then you need to add a source I'm gonna do you're gonna click monitor capture I'm gonna name it whatever you want I'm gonna name it example again example okay this just make sure capture mouse cursor is on and I guess you could play around with this if you would like. I'm not going to. Okay. No, I'm gonna use try. I'm using try. Cause that's my main one. No, duh. Don't get rid of this. You're supposed to be in example. Well, you're supposed to be in this while highlighting this bottom one. I should have made that, but I forgot. And then you might need to do some settings. I'm gonna share. I'm gonna do try and show you my settings. Broadcast settings. As you see, I have. You don't really need anything. Just make sure it says file output only, because this is recording, not streaming. I don't know what any of this other stuff. Oh, make sure it says this is the right thing. This is the right thing. <coughs> oh, this is where you're gonna have the videos go to. I have it go to my desktop. Uh, you could change it to like you click browse and then you will just put it where the videos will go when you record them. Here, I just keep this normal, and I'm actually gonna turn up my FPS because I play Minecraft and that can use 60 FPS. I would suggest using 30 because some, if you're, unless you're playing Minecraft, I'm pretty sure Minecraft can play 60. So I would suggest if you have a decent enough, and I'm using a laptop here. This is specifically for laptop. This is all work, but the end part is only for laptop. And when I click preview stream for you, if you're using laptop, it should be a black screen when I'm done with this. Audio, put this whatever you want. I have it the speakers. Default I have there. I have this is what all my settings are if you want to use it. I have some hotkeys on. I have to unmute and mute. I have F9. To start recording, I have F12. And I'm going to actually put a stop one. Stop recording, I'm going to do also F12. So, wait, F12. So it'll be the same for starting and stopping for me. Okay, apply those settings. Okay. Now for you right now i'm recording so i can't preview stream but usually when you preview stream it'll show what will happen when you record so it will show this but for people who are using a laptop don't think you have a problem this happens with most laptops it should be black there should just be a black square on your screen that's why you need to go to this you need to search wait let me just check my settings again wait my settings are good, I just want to check something, video, a oh, hotkeys, I want to check. Okay, whatever. I'm just going to go into this, I'm going to go, and, and then you need to go into, you go in NVIDIA, and then it should say NVIDIA control panel. Wanna wait for that to load? NVIDIA stuff takes forever. Well, it's loading, it's loading, it's loading. It's gonna take a while, definitely. Gotta be patient with NVIDIA. 
Okay, then you want to go to really patient just be 3d energy is manage 3d settings is what you want to go to next and then when you select a program click open broadcast software and then this do not use global settings it will should automatically be this click integrated graphics I think just froze I think bros I don't know what that means. Okay, okay, I heard you. Okay, so integrated graphics and click apply. Oh, by the way, I forgot to say when you're doing all the images earlier, click apply every time you want to do exit and whatever when you're doing settings because you gotta click apply. So make sure this says integrated graphics and this is open record software. Oh, it might start off global settings with program settings. Okay, so that's what you're gonna need to do. And then, click preview stream and you should see it should be preview if i go here oops oh no i don't have a source for this so i need to add you guys will seeing a blank screen right now sorry for that this can be example okay i'm gonna try to leave this normal and here we go this if you click start recording or click preview stream is what you should see see this is my thing i just did should work. I'm not sure how to do a game capture yet, so sorry if you're doing game capture. But it's really easy because game capture just cr captures a specific program no matter what you're in. Just simply, if you want to start in Minecraft, go into. Let's say I want to start in Minecraft. Oh, I would go into Minecraft. Then I have a hockey set as F12, so I would just click F12 to do it. That's the easiest way, probably. In, if you're not gonna, since I don't know how to do a game capture, but you don't. You could capture anything you want here. So I just was just capturing my screen, whatever I'm on. So that's how you do it. I'm going to put it back on my normal one. Goodbye, guys. That was my tutorial on how to use OBS on a laptop. Goodbye.